Leadership is something that we all encounter in our lives. It is much more than just a job title or a role in an organization. It is a quality that resides within the soul. Whether we're leading families, companies, nations or the world. It is a quality that resides within each of us, waiting to be nurtured and developed. Leadership is like a vast ocean, and each one of us has a unique stream that flows into that ocean. This is why, by studying leaders from different backgrounds, leaders, whether we agree with them or not, we get to explore these diverse streams, each with its own wisdom and perspective. This exploration is like a journey of self-discovery. We can learn from leaders near and far, gain insights that inspire and empower. As we learn, we unlock the leadership within ourselves. Now let us embark on this journey together. In a moment, we'll transition into a meditation session, which will be preceded by quotations from a leader that will help you tap your own potential leadership qualities. Now thank you for being part of this exploration and let us begin with the quotations. We must not be afraid to dream of tomorrow. The only thing worse than being blind is having sight but no vision. The only limit to our realization of tomorrow will be our doubts of today. We must find a way to break the cycle of poverty, ignorance and despair that traps so many of our people. Our nation's greatest strength is our people. The world is too small for all of us to be enemies. We must never forget that the peace we enjoy today is the fruit of the sacrifices of those who fought and died in past wars. We must always remember that the greatest threat to freedom is the abuse of power. We must be willing to act boldly in the face of danger. The moral test of government is how that government treats those who are in the least of these. Now, remember, leadership is not just about what you do. It's about who you are. To understand your own leadership abilities, it's essential to look within and reflect on the wisdom of leaders who walk diverse paths. Meditating on quotes from these leaders is like connecting with a reservoir of knowledge. It allows their insights to flow into your own consciousness, stirring your own leadership potential. In these moments of reflection, you can uncover your unique leadership style, values and principles. You'll find that the wisdom of leaders from all walks of life resonates with different aspects of your being. As we delve into our meditation session today, let us focus on these quotes. Allow those words that we repeated a while ago to guide you on a journey of your own self-discovery, revealing the leader within, revealing the you within, the real you. Now, let's get ready to embrace your leadership potential as we meditate on these profound quotes. We must not be afraid to dream of tomorrow. The only thing worse than being blind is having sight but no vision. The only limit to our realization of tomorrow will be our doubts of today. We must find a way to break the cycle of poverty, ignorance and despair that traps so many of our people. Our nation's greatest strength is our people. The world is too small for all of us to be enemies. We must never forget that the peace we enjoy today is the fruit of the sacrifices of those who fought and died in past wars. We must always remember that the greatest threat to freedom is the abuse of power. We must be willing to act boldly in the face of danger. The moral test of government is how that government treats those who are in the least of these. Now take a deep breath through your nose, fill your lungs with fresh energy. 
hold it for a moment and exhale slowly through your mouth, releasing any tensions. Again, breathe in through your nose, fill your lungs, hold, and exhale through your mouth, releasing any tensions. Once more, take a deep breath in, fully in, through your nose, fill your lungs maximum with fresh air and energy. Hold it for a moment, hold, 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 and let go, exhale through your mouth, releasing any tensions. You are here in the present moment, stay here in the present moment. If any thoughts of the past or of the future are coming into your mind, let go, acknowledge them and let go. With each breath, imagine yourself letting go of any stress, of any worries. Allow yourself fully to be in the present. Now, think of the leader, the leader whose quotations we quoted. Think about them, just for a moment. Visualize their presence, how they stood how they spoke and the qualities that made them a leader. Just think about it. Think about you standing with them. Think about you meeting them. Think about how you are them or you could be them. Imagine standing within their mind, within their body Imagine having the same feelings they were having. Now, as you breathe, shift your focus to your own leadership qualities. We all have the potential to lead in different aspects of our lives. It's within our families, communities, sports teams, cities, countries, militaries. We all have a leadership potential. Consider the unique, unique qualities that you possess, that you as a human being possess, that you possess as a leader. Are you able to connect with people on a deeper level? Are you a good listener? Do you lead by example? Acknowledge these qualities within yourself. Appreciate these qualities within yourself. This is not about being positive or negative about oneself, but about being real. These qualities exist within you. It is time for you to nurture these qualities. Now we're going to go on a deeper level. We're going to meditate on a deeper level. I'm going to count 10 to 1, and when you hear the number 1, you will be relaxed even more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, you're becoming more and more relaxed. 5, 4, 3, 2, you're much more relaxed. One, and relax. You are much more relaxed. Just bring yourself to the present moment. Any thoughts coming across your mind? Acknowledge them, let them go. Any of the noises in the background, let them be. You are here now, in the present moment. This is about you. Now, you set an intention for your leadership journey. What kind of leader do you aspire to be? How would you like to inspire and influence others? Whether within your own family or your own nation. Take a moment to visualize yourself embodying, embodying these leadership qualities. Feel yourself within this leadership position with confidence, with self-esteem and self-respect. 
feel yourself. Be here in the present moment. Acknowledge these leadership abilities within you. Now, repeat these affirmations to yourself. Quietly, silently. I hold the qualities of a great leader within me. I inspire and uplift those around me. I lead with integrity and compassion. I am a positive force for change. I hold the qualities of a great leader within me. I inspire and uplift those around me. I lead with integrity and compassion. I am a positive force for change. I hold the qualities of a great leader within me. I inspire and uplift those around me. I lead with integrity and compassion. I am a positive force for change. Feel the power of these affirmations as you continue to deep breathely. Breathe deeply, deeply breathe, deep. Remember where you are, you're here in the present moment. Just let yourself be, think deeply, breathe deeply. Know yourself deeply. You are capable of this. You are capable of much more. Now bring your awareness back to the present moment again. Remember where you are. Where you are sitting, lying or standing. Wriggle your fingers slowly and toes. And when you're ready, gently open your eyes. Open your eyes. Now, as you go about your day, remember the leadership qualities you possess. Take small steps to align yourself with the leader you aspire to be. Keep learning and growing in your leadership journey. Learn from diverse sources, not one source. Explore more books, courses, conversations with experienced leaders to explore and develop your own leadership skills. The world needs compassionate and effective leaders like you. Thank you for taking this time to reflect on your leadership potential. You have the ability to make a positive impact on the world. Remember to subscribe to my channel for more empowering content like this.